<laughs> hey everybody, it's Chris from Tipton and Hurts, and today we're happy because we're happy to be in Palm Bluff. Hey. So we've moved our location. We've got a, it's the most beautiful store. We're so excited about it. Aren't you proud of it? Proud. I'm super proud of it. And Howard. So Jay Lynn is our manager here at the beautiful Pine Bluff store and has worked now for what, three years. Working on it hard for the last couple of uh, months for sure. Exactly. So let's jump in. We're going to do a little quick walk around, meet some employees, look at some merchandise, and then we're actually going to make two arrangements in James Hayes Bowls because James Hayes is a famous glass artist here in Pine Bluff that y'all carry tons of. And so we're going to go keepsake bowl. And so anyway, come on inside. Let's go in and look Chris, around. And, and what I wanted to say is actually our location is bigger than our old. It's like 8,000 square feet. So it's, this is a big store, very big store. And we've been here for almost 80 years now. Uh, our Shepherd, Shepherd's Shepherd, has been Shepherd here for years. Slash Tipton and Hearst, we've been here for almost 80 years. Yeah. So we're happy to be in the neighborhood. Just new location and new place to go see. Right. So come on in. The Balloons Via by Christina Day. Oh, you know. Uh -huh. So this is our new location. We, of course, have always had bridal registry. We'll show you that in a minute. And, of course, we've always been known as the regional area florist, basically, right? So, and so let's look around. So we have giftware here. We have the Michelles. Have a big variety of green plants. We're bringing more in daily. We're, it's every, every day has been a new day here, basically, with new, new product coming in. Uh, we work for a couple of months getting stuff shipped in, and, of course, as like anything else, some of it comes in, some of it doesn't, so it's a daily new adventure. Chris, so, I know some people, if they ask about our... Y'all have to be close. You're not mic'd up. ...about our greenhouse, and so uh, our greenhouse is not in the shopping center, obviously, but it's just a few blocks away, so we're going to massive amounts of green plants uh, we've got a lot in here now we're gonna get a lot more absolutely so let's maybe Christina let's roll this way and then we'll end up back over there How's perfect let's okay. do it let's do it so as we said you know how we love to incorporate giftware we went with bridal registry and gift giving items as well so we've got a little bit of all that going on so this, this is, is one of my favorite tables because it's just so bright and cheerful with the and lemons lemons everybody loves lemon everyone loves lemonade chris so, talk about some of the big arrangements i know you and jay lynn i had I, I i cannot on. take any credit on that i Guy think miss Dylan did jay lots lynn of them. whomped it up. up i mean amazing i think these are some of the prettiest all white arrangements i've ever seen in my whole life i mean they are gorgeous Absolutely and gorgeous. The butterflies. I noticed this was a butter, butterfly. Uh, got a little there. bit. Of, yep. Got a little bit going on. So this is our James Hayes collection. We pulled two of these bowls. We're going to make up here in a little bit. Some simple. So designs. they have seen James Hayes on our comments sold. They we have. sold the angels. We, we do a little bit of that, especially like at Christmas time. No, we the, did the pumpkins, didn't we? I can't remember. Well, we did the tree and the oh, angel. Oh, the tree that was in the, the angel. We did the tree, and we've done some different things on that. This, this is the home of James Hayes. Uh, is this Pine Bluff? This is probably what y'all have seen, the trees. Yeah. Well, I collect true. James Hayes, so yep. I love his product. Yep, he does jewelry, he does just a wide variety of stuff. And I think this is, it, I, I assume this is a, his biggest outlet as far as in Pine Bluff for sure. Yeah. So let's go back around this way. Beatrice Ball, we've got Arkansas pillows, America pillows. So this is our bridal register area, and every table is going to be a different bride. They're getting those set up. We're working on that right now. And it's kind of like old school. We're used to go and see what all the bride have picked out. Well, we're doing the same thing here. So like this table, this bride has registered for Christmas china. So yep. her Christmas china is on display. And this is by Jaleska. And so, and so we have a wide variety starting down there with the Beatrice Ball. Then it goes into Annie Glass. And then what's that co company Pacific called? Pacific Merchant. Pacific Merchant. Beatry, Jaleska. Uh, Casafina, a little bit of everything. So we're super excited about that. Artea Italica. Yep. 
and then the holiday because a lot of people register for holiday even though it's you know yeah well they may wanna, right well, now well you want to get a gift we well, that's get right. It, right so so then we come around this way this is our little display today yeah come and so get we a did cupcake little lemon cakes and showing you how to work on a lemonade so we'll go back to this into here they got a little bit of jewelry, some handbags. Of course, they, they are able to carry Nest candles. We can't carry Nest at the Heights location because it's area code protected, but they carry a big variety of Nest here. Absolutely. I think this table's really fun, too. Yeah. Very I, summery. Yeah, somebody just came in and bought one a bit off <laughs> of a did. minute ago. You spruced it up, and then they, there, there you go. There, there we go. It. And, you know, we're traditional florists, so we still do a ton of funeral work and we still do a, f a ton of things for for cemeteries and so Guileen and Jaylen yeah, that's one of your specialties y'all do a ton of a, a lot of silks you know for cemeteries and funerals and you know they can't really keep up with it but they still do a lot of it uh, probably three times more than we do in the height store so anyway Chris mentioned our, our ribbon. Oh my gosh, we've got a fantastic assortment of ribbons. They, they love a bow down here, so it, exactly. <laughs> right, Colleen? So we have a big variety of ribbon. We just got a ton of new ribbon in as well, but they sell like a, like a lot of bows. Y'all like the new ribbon that came in? You do? Good. Good, good, good. We've got that in all different sizes as well. Size, shapes, colors. Size, uh -huh. So let's meet some people so this is the person that has ran the store for 38 years basically this is miss guileen she worked with she worked with john shepherd and she uh, so graciously stuck with us came back who came back and helped us and, and we could not do it without her so you you just do it all don't you do it all do it all and then we have cody and i was so excited i almost called and said cody would you please dye your hair green today and she did it for me anyway. So there you go. She is in the Tenderhurst mode for sure. So Cody's been with us for about since December. Since December. But I also worked for Shepherd. Oh, you did? I didn't know that. Awesome. She well, worked at the Hot Springs. A Hot Springs location. All right. So we're excited to have her as well. And we have Miss Ashley over here on, on the – wave at us, Ashley. Here we go. She's like, I'm going to hide behind the computer. Yeah. And of course, we have Cassandra and Shelby. They're from the Height Store. They came down with us to help out with the opening for the barrage of people. And so, and then we have Miss Dixie. And look who popped up. Miss Grace is here as well. Y'all, Miss Dixie. So they're working on a bride right now. So they're getting that all worked out. And Dixie is our interior decorator. So she works out of this location. And a fantastic and job. She's my interior decorator, too. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> she's my friend. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and then we can't forget our last employee, our, Ari. Our last employee, but newest employee. She started Saturday. This is Miss Ari. She's here. And, and she's doing a great job for yeah. just starting Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> just starting better, Saturday. Better than I would. She jumped into the fire. Better than I would. So we're going to get run over here. We actually have a couple people here that have come to watch the hat. Are they still here? They might have. I don't know if they left or not. But let's go ahead and get started over here. So what we thought, oh, we didn't show you the cooler, did we? Well, we did. Yeah, we better show. Yeah. We were going to swing back this way. Yeah, that's right. So this is our cut flower cooler. So you can just reach in and get what you want. Do you want, want even some rainbow roses? You rainbow, can even get that here, y'all. rainbow roses, and we even got blue roses. There's Ooh, man. So this is our cut flower cooler. So you're always more than welcome at any tip in the hearse to come in and pick out your own flowers. Our coolers are always open to go into where you can walk in. We're not quite ready. We're still working on it, but you know, Rome went built in build the day. And so they're getting ready for their weekly orders going out so this is the back is the back storage and this will be the front storage as well so like I said we are a bread and butter traditional florist 90% and then you know we do events and we do bridal registry so 
like I've always said, we sell everything, but unleaded gas. So does Miss Frida order flowers for all of the locations? Miss Frida takes care of all the locations. She does. She does. So I'm going to have you tape there. So what we're going to do is we're going to use. I just wanted to mention the fantastic job our people did building this store. We built it ourselves, the layout, the the columns, the the uh, trellis, the tables, Dixie, our interior decorator, you know, planned it all out. Absolutely. Billy, our, uh, Billy Wilson and Billy Blake. Billy Wilson, our operation, our uh, um, delivery manager. Yeah. Jack of all trade, Jack. master none. Yeah. So there you he, go. He does this carpentry and he did all the IT work. So uh, yeah. we're, uh, we couldn't do it without you, Billy. Yeah. So, and Blake, and we had every, all, the whole delivery department helped out. Just like we say, it takes a team takes to do a everything. Village. Takes a village. So, this first one I'm going to work with, and we're going to work with these colors. So, this is a James Hayes bowl. And James Hayes sells his bowls by size, right? So, this one is 175. So, I've already put water in there. And I was asking them for some chicken wire earlier, and they're like, we don't use chicken wire down here. So I'm like, well, I guess I'm going to have to learn how to not to use chicken wire today, right? So I had a knife. Oh, there, I, I, I borrowed your knife. <laughs> I, I borrowed your knife. So all we're going to do is we're just going to cross grid this one. I really didn't want to put foam in there because the foam would, probably would not look as well. So how is everybody doing out there today? Everybody is good. Good. Well, awesome. So what we want to everybody do Everybody said the store is amazing. They said, wow, Miss Frida to buy flowers for everybody. That's pretty she amazing. She does. She does. So we're going to use two hydrangeas as a base. Just like that. We're going to cross that over to there. We're going to go back and add a couple of our berries into here. Miss Abby is from Pine Bluff, but she lives in Oklahoma now. Well, we are so excited to be here. I, I'm just so excited for y'all to have this store, though. I just think we're going to just, yeah. So with everything being not in foam, we're going to have to cross grid this. So now we're going to go back and add our heist into the middle like that we have three of those man these are going to be so pretty when they open look how pretty that color is going to be with that bowl i can zoom in on it today i'm not on the ladder so yeah. i can move in you don't know what to think do you i don't no, whole new perspective <laughs> i don't really like it no i'm just kidding yeah. everyone is loving the james hayes bowl too oh, good the kale i love the kale so i'm going to mimic doing two here i'm going to do two kale there so are okay. you kind of making the um miss jennifer arrangement in a way uh could be you or know, not really well you know that picture that's more that weird not weird but different lavender color so let's i think you know so i sometimes wonder if that's just bad for the bad you know photography came off wrong on that one maybe so maybe so i was just thinking with the purple and the blue with the kale it, it, it's all those cool water colors so now we're going to go back and add just three just a little pop of white here in the middle and i'm going to block those together like that. I'm going to clean that off to here. I'm going to take that net off now. Everyone's loving the bowls. Oh, good. Miss Brandy said she's calling me to buy this bowl. Oh, well, good. You ring my digits, but wait until after the happy. Yep. So, what's the spiky stuff that you put in? That. The blue thistles, thistle. A Andrew, I always say it wrong. You say it wrong. I always say the wrong. A Andrew, uh, Andrium, or, or someone help me with it. Well, we call it blue thistle. We call it blue thistle. We <laughs> don't need to be fancy we, we, around yeah. here. Yeah. They start doing big names, and I don't. So now let's go back and add a little bit of burr. Go back and add this. Oh, it's so pretty. We're going to let our cow lilies give us our length. And we're going to use the natural bowl because that bowl weaves like this. So we're just going to lay those cow lilies right into there. Miss Lana is so sad she missed us. She didn't get to come today. We had a couple people. One lady from Whitehall said we that did. she came in front. She used to live in England, wasn't it? 
I wasn't and she sure. Watched, she started watching us right at the beginning. She retired right at the beginning, and she hasn't missed one yet. I guess she got tired of waiting on us. That might be. Oh, my she goodness. might have had somewhere to go. Other pla places to go and people to see. That's right. You never know. So I always want to make sure when I'm putting those in to keep the noses going out that way, like that, almost like a waterfall. When you take the nose lap that way, it tends to make the eye look like it's the lines are crossing. A few people are very impressed. I mean, how could you not that you are making an arrangement like this in a bowl without a grid? Well, live and learn, right? Oh, Miss Patricia said, I wish I could have stayed longer and joined you today. Uh, Christina, you were so gracious and wonderful to give us a tour. So Mr. Chris is truly a gifted artist. That's Miss Pat that came on Friday. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Well, we had fun. I assume they made it where they were going then, right? Uh, they were going back to St. Louis. Uh, they where were, they were yes, from. what I was saying. Made it back home to where they were going. So That's let's right. do another one real quick. So on this one, this bowl is so shallow, but it's so cool because it's on a little pedestal. And this bowl is 80, only $85. So, like I said, he does it in sizes by the pricing by size. So, what we're going to do with this, Jay Lens, I'm actually going to make a simple hand tie because really there's no way for me to work in there. So, what I want to do is I'm actually going to make it to spill out this way. Okay? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a piece of this, which is Italian Ruscus. Ruscus. I'm going to take two pieces of that. I'm actually going to take another piece and we finish, and I'm going to curve it like that. Okay? So now let's go back and start doing our layers. So we're going to take two hydrangea. We're going to put one here, and I'm going to put one there. Okay? Then we're going to go back and add that, and we're going to block those two together. So, tell you what, can you do me a favor and help me clean those real quick? And if you'll take those thorns off, we're going to do the knife. Here's the knife. If you'll take that off for me, that would be awesome. Uh, yes, ma'am. That. Everyone's saying it's such a lovely store. We're super excited about it. They've done an amazing job in it all together. You know, it's been a little stressful, hasn't it? Miss Jessica <laughs> asked, when are we opening a store in Sweden? Uh, oh, my goodness. I have friends that live in Sweden. I can come and see them. You Miss Grace, Grace said Grace she'll go with Grace us, too. She is happy to go do that. Oh, I'll be in Sweden. And Dixie there. See, yeah. we've got a team. we got a lot of people jumping ship around here, it sounds like. Yeah, they're also jumping ship to go to Sweden to open a tip in her, so... We get you get me one more of those. So Elaine just said, is anybody watching going to Jane's Farmer event in Perry, Georgia this weekend? We actually had James Farmer here just a few weeks ago. And Mr. Chris did flowers for uh, his event. We did. Like that. We're going to block that. Now I'm going to take a little bit of tape. Can I get a pair of cutters from you real quick? That'd be easier just to cut those real quick. So I'm just going to tape this off just like a little hand tie. Like this. So Miss Jessica said her door is always open. She lives in Gothenburg on the west coast of Sweden. Well, fine. Well, we'll just stop by and say yeah, hello. Yeah, we'll just pop in someday. So now we're going to take that. We're just going to lay it just in just like that. And sometimes you just have to modify it just a little bit once you get it in there. And modification means you can always go back and cross more flowers into it. There's the cutter. So how far is Pine Bluff from our other store? Um, it's about 45 40 minutes. minutes now. <laughs> I'm going to add one more lily over to here. 
that what you were thinking? Miss mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Cody pulled all the flowers for me, so I told her, make me a surprise. So there we go. So that's what we've got today. I think that does our happy. For, I think we've done a little bit of happy today in Pine Bluff. We're excited to be here again. We will see you on Wednesday with more Mother's Day specials because it's this week. <laughs> so it's happening. So anyway, thanks for joining us. Thanks for being part of the happy, and we'll see you soon. Bye.